The world's most powerful Western governments will hold an emergency conference to handle the situation. Ukraine's condition is deteriorating. After Russia's targeting of civilian areas major cities were destroyed across the country. More than 80 Russian missiles shook the country. Strikes during the morning rush hour what looks to be the greatest wave of the hour since the first week of the season during the conflict, one of the objectives was a, a well-known pedestrian bridge in Kiev is the capital. Putin stated that the assaults were in response to collapse of a vital bridge connecting over the weekend, Russia visited Crimea. According to Ukrainian officials, at least 14 people were killed. Almost 100 people were murdered and nearly 100 more were injured in a dozen or more cities Vice President Biden late last night, I spoke with President Zelensky today over the phone, and he promised to offer assistance to Ukraine, including advanced he requested air defense equipment the U.S. Embassy in Kiev has encouraged all Americans to people are being asked to leave the nation immediately air raid sirens have been installed. You can hear it all day and night here. Hear them now, this city has also been Attacked like more than a dozen cities throughout the world country we must inform you that this report includes pictures that some people may find unsettling Russian military launched a lethal attack. Ongoing terror campaign throughout Ukraine firing their most potent long-range missile weaponry in the most common attack since the beginning of the invasion Putin's war machine targeted more. People. More than a dozen locations in a concerted effort bombardment keep in mind that numerous strikes on the capital are possible. Downtown's beating heart on the streets, automobiles are exploding in flames. Near Maidan Square, an explosion occurred in in the midst of rush hour a burning crater near a children's playground playground frightened young lady on social networking describing a single explosion ferocious fireball of the captive next miraculously escaping from serious injury according to the Ukrainian president, they are looking for they have two targets, panic and chaos. Our energy industry, as well as our people Russian retribution for the bombing of the bridge between Russia and Crimea President Vladimir Putin issued a statement today. It is a terrorist attack warning. Worse repercussions if it is not repeated only affecting a vital Russian supply without taking a direct shot at Putin who drove across the bridge himself when it officially opens in 2018. The Ukrainians were left scrambling for retaliation. For the first time in months, I found sanctuary. Kiev citizens seeking. Sanctuary in the fear grips the city subways once more. But performing folk music together in defiance is another worrying development tonight, Belarus's president announced the formation of a combined military task force with relation to Russia Belarus was offered as an example. Staging area for Russian forces in Ukraine's initial invasion so many Norris new advancements. If you loved the video please hit a like button and don't forget to subscribe the channel.